What's good, beautiful people? It is your boy, The Session. And if you're watching this right now, that means you decided that you want to make some money and you want to make some money right now. And the first thing we need to do before we make some money is look like money. We need to feel like money. So I suggest before you watch this, put on your favorite shirt, put on your favorite jacket, put on your favorite outfit. I don't care if you're not going anywhere. Don't care if you just came home from work. Put it on. Get fresh. Sit down. Now, what I have for you is three steps. I'm talking about three I'm talking about three steps that are going to make you money, not might, not may. They will make you money if you execute and if you want it. How confident I am that these three steps will help you is, is I give you two examples. One, I made a video that you will be seeing uh, on YouTube. If you're watching this live, you're going to be seeing a video that's going to be Friday. It's going to show you exactly how to make money. I have hands-on screenshots showing you where I ranked. I was a private chef and I was the top ranked private chef in all of the Bay. I'll show you how I did it. Show you what apps I used. How confident I am is that. And also, I'm willing to tell you that if you do this for 30 days and you don't make at least $500 to $1,000 doing these methods, at least $500 to $1,000 depending on your age and skill, skill set, I will go live with you. On Instagram, I will go live with you and I will personally help you figure out ways to make some extra money. And then I will shout you out on my Instagram and I'll give you some money. That's how confident I am that you will be self-sufficient. I'm not saying you'll be able to drive a Maserati, but you may. You know what I mean? Just by taking these steps, I'm guaranteeing you can make some extra money. And it's getting you one step closer to quit that nine to five, to become more self-sufficient and dependent upon yourself. You feel me? All right, so without further ado, let's get it started. I'm gonna show you the three ways starting now. And the first way, you, you are going to be able to make some money if you're willing to, and if you're obviously physically able to, um, is through TaskRabbit. Yes, I said TaskRabbit. Um, I've mentioned this in master classes before. Um, if you've ever had a consulting call or coaching call with me, you know we talk about this. Um, TaskRabbit, uh, there's plenty of other alternatives, the thumbtacks, uh, whatever else you, you can find and brew up. Uh, they have an app called Nextdoor, Care.com, whatever. I, I just know about thumbtack um, extremely well. Um, you can pick whichever one you like. But when you get this application, I'll pop it up here on the screen. You will see that they have an unlimited amount of choices um, of actual you know services that you can offer. You can see my man here is making damn near $40 an hour delivering groceries. You can fix cabinets, you can repair things. There's endless uh, possibilities and offerings as long as you're physically able and you have a curious mind. So some of the things they offer even more are delivery services, home repairs, general cleaning, uh, yard work, plumbing, painting, air conditioner, uh, furniture moving, yard work, um, weed removal, wardrobe consulting, pet food delivery, office desk setup, disinfecting services. I mean, the list goes on and on and on and you can see for yourself as clear as day. Now, when you go in there, they're, they're gonna have, you know, some, it's all self-explanatory. So they'll be able to tell you, hey, generally speaking for this type of work, this is the price in which people charge. So you can see, you don't have to go make your own price up and don't have to worry about, hey, Sesh, I don't have no experience in this. I'm, as long as you believe in yourself and you think you can execute, I mean, moving furniture doesn't require necessarily that much thinking per se. Um, organizing drawers, clerical work. If you're good on the computer and you know how to tweet your ass off and do all this other shit, why not get paid to tweet for a company? Why not go over here on TaskRabbit and find yourself something you can make some money on? You can set your own price. It will show, so I'm gonna be hypothetical. Let's say y'all go to work. I know a lot of y'all got nine to fives. You going to work, but when you go to work, there's no guarantee that um, you're gonna earn extra amount of money. Let's say you work somewhere where you get paid a set amount. It doesn't matter how much extra actual productivity you do there, your pay is always gonna be the same. Meanwhile, it's here, your pay is uh, dependent upon you. You set the price. If you wanna work a little extra more, go grab another gig. Go do something here. You could be a bartender, whatever. The, the, the opportunities are endless on here. And I just want you to understand that. And here are here's the key about TaskRabbit. Dig this, peak game. So the energy you have that your reputation precedes you. So before you go somewhere, people say, oh, you know about Sesh, man. They're either going to say he's cool or he's not. So if you develop a good rapport with the clients or customers you help a task rabbit, let's say you work with them one time, two times, three times. Now you start talking about sports, start talking about things they're interested in. 
you get to know the person. Now you may be able to say, fuck that. Let's work together one-on-one. -on -one. You get hired under a contract now. Now, just like that, you can quit that nine to five and hop into a task rabbit job. Or you get cool with the family. Just like I, when I was a chef, I would get, I wasn't on this app per se, but I know that they would hire helpers for dinner parties from TaskRabbit. So you never know how wealthy the person is. They may be wanting to have a birthday party. They may be wanting to have a party at the beach. They may want you to be a nanny. I'm not sure, but I know that if you continue to develop good rapport, they'll give you other opportunities. They'll give you other opportunities and chances for you to make more money just by you being amazing and having good energy. So imagine getting paid to have good energy. You know, um, you could have been working at the warehouse or you could have been working at Target, Sephora. I'm not sure where y'all work. I've noticed that on Instagram, my, my female viewers have increased by 40%. So I now know that women are on me as well now too. The eyes are on me. So I want it to be equal. No matter where you're working at, understand that you can change this just by having good rapport, just by having an open mind. Go on the motherfucking website, check it out. Um, and they could also hire you foolish time. So I know if you want to start your own side business, a lot of you are maybe just looking for extra money so you can start your business. So this can be the, the, the foot in the door just so you can get, you know, they may hire you 30 hours a week. Okay, 30 hours. Now you still have X amount of hours to work and do your own shit for your own business. You don't have to work in an office. It's way less stressful. I don't know what you do. You smoke something, do whatever you want on your break. Do what you like to do. I don't know. Do what you want. But it's much more lenient and it's much more... Uh, free, if you know what I mean. So the first one is Task Rabbit. Let me know what you think. Okay, at numeral dose, the second thing I want you to do after you all Task Rabbit it up and you're ready to go, like I told you, there's other alternatives to, to Task Rabbit as well. So if you want to check out on the Thumbtack or wherever, you're lit. Step number two is find business owners slash entrepreneurs. Okay, when you find small business owners in particular, a lot of them are just starting. Even if they're not just starting, even a person like myself, I was, uh, you know, started out as doing a private chef, then switched over to private chef and consulting, and then switched over to just consulting, and then switched over to consulting and influencership. You can cover a wide basis, right? So when you first start, a lot of people need help. You may not have the best website. They may not have um, a delivery driver. They may not have someone to organize the storefront. What I'm telling you is when you find these local, whether they're local or they're far away, you can offer them something. So right here, if you locate all your homies and your friends that have a business, that's leads for you right there. Go on Instagram. If you oh, I don't know which one of my friends, go on Instagram. They've probably been posting about it. You've been ignoring it. Go look at their posts. Go look on Facebook. Check it out. And I'm guaranteeing you find at least 10 friends, acquaintances, pardon, that have businesses. Reach out to these people. Hey, I see you got a business. Hey, I, you just started? Yeah. Who organized your storefront? I do that. I have a real interest in interior decorating, interior design. Hey, do you, oh, I do waste management. Do you need somebody to take some of that removal away? I got you. Um, hey, you need a new logo. Hey, I need a new, um, what you call those? Like a, a intro video, when they, a, a training video for uh, new hires. Um, I need clerical work done. If you... After you go through your friends, you're going to find a couple of them, at least 10 of them. Boom, you got them. Next, what you could do is take your phone that you're on all day. Chances are, if you have a nine to five, you don't like your job. So on your lunch break and in, in between time and in the meantime, you on this motherfucker doing something. So take your phone, you go on Instagram. Now, when you go on Instagram, instead of looking at whatever the hell and comparing your life to that and wondering why you're not that, go here to hashtags, okay? You type in small business. Who would have thought? Now, when you type in small business and you hit search, stuff's going to happen. Things come up and look at all these pictures. Look at all these people, all different flavors and types. The more specific you get with the hashtag, obviously, the more specific the people will come up that are related to that. But you have endless leads on here. So by going on here, checking hashtags, joining Facebook groups, um, Pinterest, Meetup, whatever, finding people who have small businesses it's not difficult because there's a lot of them now. The, 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 what separates small businesses is, are they successful? Are they profitable? That's what separates them. Everyone has a small business and a side hustle. Everyone's a CEO of their own shit, but are they profitable? You can go to them with that. Like, hey, I can, make, I can help you be profitable. I can help your business. I can add to your business. I like your vision. I like what you have to offer, friend, who I haven't supported in a while. But this is what I can bring to the table. This is what I can bring. 
you may have to do that thing free one time. Go ahead and do it free one time. After you do it, at least you'll be able to, you know, have experience under your belt. You'll be able to show that person you're real. And then when they see the quality of, like some, um, somebody did some camera work for me or some, um, you know, a graphic design for some music I made, I like the way that looks. So what's that mean? I'm going to hire them full time. I'm going to hire them for my next project. Now I, now my gra my editing and how I do the little small video, I have a girl for that. I hired someone for that. And I'm going to put you on game. A lot of these companies, right? Let's say it's a company with the actual storefront. They have businesses that, I mean, pardon, they have employees that come in there, you know, real people that wear button ups and everything, right? A lot of them need logos. A lot of them need um, training videos created. A lot of them need uh, voiceover work or whatever you can literally charge them i don't know how much you want five six seven eight hundred go ahead over to fiverr and upward get it done for 50 bucks get it done for 75 bucks you pocket the rest i'm not telling you to do that to every person but when you go there hire the best worker from fiverr or upward whatever their price is even if it's 150 bucks you pocket 350 you pocket four five six. you get what i'm saying and keep re wash rinse and repeat that cycle you will continue to be abundant. That's going to boost your confidence. It's going to boost your resume. It's going to boost your energy toward attracting money to you immediately. The more you want money, the more you tell yourself, hey, this is amazing. I, I want money. You're going to get more of it. And another bonus of when you outsource the work to Fiverr or Upwork is it gives you more free time to take on more people. So imagine you get your first person that wants the logo. Boom. Holla at Fiverr and Upwork. Get that cooking. By the time you reach out to more people and you get another two two clients, now you only spend an hour a day just making sure their work's done, communicating with the Fiverr worker, checking their work, making sure everything's cool, communicating back with the company, just saying, hey, I got everything under control. You got the rest of your day free to handle your, your work, your business, your kids, whatever. I don't know what you got going on, but boom. So the second one is find entrepreneurs and business owners that are either local or nationwide. It doesn't matter. All right, last but certainly not least is, you see these? A fork, some chopsticks. You got to get hungry and you got to remove emotion. Yes, get hungry. We need to eat. Listen, I'm going to tell you some very important information. Some very, 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 very important information. Okay? Let's say you have um, a home, right? Let's say you live with some, you got roommates and shit. You could have a motherfucking dog, right? So you got a dog, a pig, or whatever it is. You love it to bits. Oh my God, this is amazing. woo -hoo. I love them. But let's say your people you live with don't give a damn about them. They don't care. They never ask for it to be there. You have to understand that they don't love your pet the same way you do. If you have a child, the same way you love that person, the world doesn't. It's just a person. So when you understand... When you understand that no one owes you anything, no one is made to just give you some extra money. No one's, if, if I own a business, I'm not supposed to reach out to you. You're supposed to reach out to me because you're hungry. You're, you're looking to see a person or persons with success and you want to reach out to them and show what you have to offer. You thinking that oh, everything's, everybody's supposed to love what you love. Everybody's supposed to just um, do what you want. Everybody's supposed to just, you know, um, give you money or for some reason give you a handout you're living in a, a an illusion you're delusional to be honest and that way it's not going to get you very far but what i'm telling you is once you understand that you're hungry you want this shit if you look at these numbers if you hit up five small businesses per day for seven days that's one week five businesses seven days a week that's 35 businesses how long would it take for you to write up an email or a dm to a business or a small business it doesn't take long. And peep game, I'm going to blow your mind. Once you get it written, you copy and paste it. Save it somewhere. I have all the other in-depth information in another video. But you can save it somewhere. Now you then send those five businesses or people almost the same thing to tailor it a bit. Now you're going about your business. Go keep doing your nine to five. Keep doing your nine to five, right? But you understand at the end of the, end of the week, you have 35 new people that you've reached out to. And at a 10% conversion rate, that's 3.5 people that will respond back. So you have almost four people that will respond back to you and say, hey, yes or no, I do want to work. I do need that. 
If they say no to one thing, maybe they want to do, maybe you can help them with some other shit they got going on. At least you get you in the mix. You got some leads now. Some people that are small business owners that do respond, that do need help probably. Now, if you want to go the hungry way, if you want to do a little bit more, you can hit up 20 businesses per day with the copy and paste method, tailor it to each person. After seven days, that's 140 businesses, 140 businesses, okay? After you hit up 140 businesses with a 10% conversion rate, that is 14 businesses that will respond back to you. Imagine if you can do even 10 of them logos. If you could do even 10 of those logos and you charging 350 a pop, 300, four, 500 a pop. Come on now, you gotta think, there's money out here to be made. So if you can get each business to spend $300 with you, then not only do you win, you also build your resume because every person you work with, now you go to your resume. Yeah, I do this now. I make logos for this company. Have made successful logos for, enlist the company. This is how you build your resume. This is how you finesse. This is how you get ahead the legal way, the proper way. You're building intelligence. You're learning repetition. You're learning how to be hungry and go get it yourself how to go get it yourself, put plays together. We are playmakers, it's a manifestor game. And I'm telling you, if you do what I suggest, the numbers are here. And if you feel as though after 30 days, you cannot make at least $500, holler at me. Hit me up, I'll go live with you and I will help you live. I'll help you live, make some money. This, it's impossible that you can do these and not make at least 500, you gotta get off your ass. Some of these don't even require you to go somewhere. If it's clerical work, you can stay at your crib and do it, okay? I love you, make sure you, like this video. Um, I think it's going to be a private link, so I'm not sure if you can share it. But the good news is, is tomorrow I'm going to have an even more in-depth video for you. So you're going to love it. I love you. Make sure you stay tuned. This is amazing masterclass. This is how to make money right now with your boy, The Session. Yudi.